Get out of the city and into an adventure that moves the whole family. Prepare to be moved. The all new Nissan X Trail. On air, online, and on your smart speaker. Birdie Blue. Handcrafted Alana Maria jewelry. Available in store and online. SAFM News Briefing. Hey, it's Amy Ross with you. Fingers and toes are crossed for Limestone Coasters paying off a home when the RBA meets today on rates. After a pause last month, mortgage holders will be hoping things are kept on hold again at 4.1%. However, Combank is predicting one more rise to 4.3%. Australia's first national tree scorecard's been released and South Australia is top of the class. It assesses which states and territories are leading the way in restoring trees with SA rating as good coming in at first on the ladder. Hilary Herman from the World Wild Fund for Nature Australia says protecting trees is so important. The bird life and the insects and the lizards, I mean, it's incredible what the habitat changes. Good news for workers east of the border. Victorian workers are claiming more than $1 million in unpaid long service leave last financial year with the help of the state government's wage inspectorate. Around 14,000 workers recovered lost entitlements, including a worker who was owed more than 20 k Commissioner of Wage Inspectorate Victoria Robert Hordle says help isn't just for workers, but for employers too. These are long-standing laws in Victoria and there's actually quite serious penalties if they're not complied with, so it's better to be informed and prepared ahead of time. Employers can call us on 1800 287 287 and get access to free and accurate advice. And a new plan to protect the southeast biodiversity could soon come into play. A statewide truck washing and effluent facility network is on the state government's table to bolster South Australia's biosecurity. After this, there is no turning back. You sip the red can, the story ends. You sip the black can, you enter dreamland. And I show you just how good the truth can taste. Take the Pepsi Max Taste Challenge. Close one in the Limestone Coast Football Association at the weekend. A top of the table women's clash saw Apollo get on top of internationals 2-1. Elsewhere, Central's kept Narracourt United scoreless, winning 3-0. And a goal haul from Blue Lake saw the side beat Millicent United 4-0. Join the community that helps make wishes come true. Visit makeawish.org.au to make your donation today. That's makeawish.org.au. Buying or selling rural or residential properties, Miller, Wan and John. This is SAFM Weather. 15 with a possible shower for the rest of the day across the limestone coast. Tomorrow, 17 and more wet weather on Thursday. It's the daily stories that matter in under 20 minutes. Search the briefing podcast on Listener. Download the app now and listen for free. Look at